Hey everyone, welcome back. I want to go over a specific industry that not a lot of people touch on. I'm actually getting pretty familiar with and it's pretty interesting to be honest. And I'm going to just show you guys a quick clip. I mean, like, check this out. How cool is this, right? It's online slot machines, but I want to elaborate a little bit more on that because there's a whole industry here. I'm not promoting gambling. That's the last thing I want to do, but there is a huge industry. There is a lot of casinos and there's a lot of slot machines online gaming is another industry in itself and we call it gaming industry but it's not what you think it's not the blizzards it's not rockstar or anything we're talking about online sports book betting slot machines roulette tables any games that used to be where there used to be a physical person dealing the cards or doing the activity is now automated with a machine. Craps table is another one where it's all electronic now. If you ever gone to a casino, I'm not advocating to go to a casino. They do have some interesting technology that has progressed throughout time. So where am I getting at with this? I want to kind of just show you guys right now. There is a whole industry of with slot machines. They're all running IP addresses can be compromised with malware. They definitely need patching. They're always needing to be updated. There is definitely a lot to go over and I want to review that with you guys. So before we even begin, I want to show you a little quick clip of what these conventions are and what they showcase and what they actually have. And I'm going to get to the whole career section of it in a, in a short bit, but let's just pay a little bit of attention to this first. It is amazing and I want to point out something really specific here. I mean, they need developers, they need manufacturers, they need programmers, they need cybersecurity experts. Why? Because each one of these devices sit on an IP address that's probably segregated on a VLAN and they need protection the same way as if it was another machine on a corporate, a bank or a healthcare. And all of this has to do with cybersecurity because it's just a new trend that everything is going. I actually did a search on Google and I was asking what is the biggest industry that requires cybersecurity? And it listed out a whole bunch of things, right? Banking, healthcare, but to be really honest, it's every single industry, retail, uh, supermarkets and, you know, clothing stores and of course healthcare, uh, schools, education right all these categories the government so on and so forth i want to point out like these companies may or may not always advertise on the biggest job boards right so you have things like atlantis casino resort now this one in particular i had open because i just randomly picked one from this list right i went to zip recruiter and i was looking at like cybersecurity in casinos now, it may not happen in every state that has these large casinos. Let's see. There's a whole bunch in Reno, Nevada. Obviously, it's a huge casino presence there because it's, you know, it's like the world of uh, casinos over there. Atlantic City in New Jersey is also. You can see there isn't a shortage of jobs within casinos. So I had this one open. It was uh, Reno, Nevada. And, you know, it, it just goes through. You need to know the same things for any industry in relation to cybersecurity. So if you have cybersecurity skills, and of course you can see right here, engineer, implement and monitor security measures to protect computer system. That's very generic. You could, you could get that kind of experience anywhere and you can utilize that going into different industries. So let me just point out some of the top brands that produces these slot machines. You have some really big players here, Konami, you have a Euro games, you have uh, and another one is IGT in the United States. You have Betsoft Valley's technologies. I actually have a few of them open right now. Now I want to point out Konami is the same group of guys that brings you Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles on the video game Konami. So here we're talking about the same Konami that brings you Contra, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and a whole bunch of other games that you you probably grew up with. They are the same people that build and make slot machines, which is pretty dope, right? In my opinion, you have IGT, which is another big one. 
and of course you you know there's there's so many of them that actually have these online play to mimic what their slot machine is virtually and you can do that of course like even these online slots and there's plenty of them there is not a shortage of this and everyone is competing they're in this market so with all that competition with all these slot machines have you ever walked into a casino floor you're gonna see like hundreds and hundreds of slot machines and each one of them have an ip address so casinos are looking for talent as well so don't omit that i mean this is another industry that hasn't really been tapped and i think as things are developing for them they're getting out of that traditional state of you know slot machines used to be just you plug into electricity you pull the lever and that's it it used to store all the coins now it's holding credit it's gathering information it's gathering membership information you can even put your credit card on it now and you're you're depositing money into the machine just so you can play so there's a lot of technology being put into these slot machines or the casino in general any game not just slot machines i keep mentioning slot machines because i'm fascinated with them i love the lights i love the glitter and it's really addicting to be honest but what my point is there is another industry start searching that if you're in one of these areas and i'm pretty sure if you're living in a state or even across the country there's other countries that have you know these casinos that have machines that just need cybersecurity protection and it's going to range from beginner to intermediate to advanced and they're going to have all these different levels they're going to have their sock analysts they're going to have you know the compliance officers they're going to have the security engineers they need people to build out these things to protect the casino the entirety of it not just the games they're going to have the surveillance cameras they're going to have physical security access to like different areas uh, with proximity cars all those are configured and managed by IT, which obviously has a whole industry in itself. And the market right now for them, there's no shortage of jobs. They need more people in this sector, especially cybersecurity, to keep them well protected. So I just want to bring that to light that no one has ever really talked about. There's not one video talking about cybersecurity in the gaming casino industry. And this is probably the first one that you're going to see me talking about. So I am familiar with the industry and I enjoy working in it. And it's a lot of fun, guys. So just want to bring that to light. And I just want to add that I've been reviewing these resumes. I've been sending out Zoom invites for you guys. And I love the engagement. So please do not stop. And I'm trying to get back to everyone that has been reaching out to me. So I'm trying to find all the time that I can to put these half hour sessions or email you back so we can go over and review what it is that you can put on there to get yourself into a cybersecurity role. So I want to thank everyone. I'll catch you guys again soon. Take care.